Hey everyone, so I'm coming on again live for um, weekly oil chats. So this Wednesday, I'm going to be talking about Cypress. So it's not as a well-known oil as um, other ones like lavender, lemon, and peppermint, but I do really love it. So I actually use this a lot, which is why I decided to choose it today and talk about it. So here are some key things about it that make it very useful in a lot of the homes, I'd say. So first of all, it's very good for oily skin and hair. So if you add a drop to your moisturizer, if you do have a more oily complexion, you can add a drop to your moisturizer to help combat that. Or how I like to use it, um, I actually use it today, is I add a drop to my shampoo and then lather it in and then rinse it out. So it can help with, um, you know, keep your hair less oily or less greasy um, and hopefully last a bit longer than had you not used the oil. Another really awesome thing about it is it's really good for cellulite. So it actually helps improve the circulation of your, your skin, so that's why it's a good one to use. Um, so you could combine it with grapefruit, which is what I do. So cypress and grapefruit together is a great cellulite combatter. Um, and the great thing about cypress is it actually penetrates through the cellular layers to help break up and release the cellulite. Or you can use it on var varicose veins, just on location, wherever those are. Um, it's also one of my ingredients in my perfect deodorant com or perfect deodorant blend. So why I add cypress to my deodorant? Well, it helps clear the lymph system since you're putting um, deodorant on your armpits, obviously. That's where your lymph system exists. So it's very good for the lymph system. It helps promote the, cir the circulation of it and clear it. Um, it's also, cypress is actually antibacterial, so obviously it's good for use in a deodorant that way. And it's super beneficial for times of excessive sweat loss. So I mean, in these hot summers, it's more beneficial then. So adding it to the deodorant will help with, you know, the, the release of fluids. Um, and also it's a lymphatic decongestant. So which means that it helps, it helps the fluids flow properly through the system. So there's no blockage. So any purse sprints in that they're blocking the ducts, whereas this is helping it, you know, run as it smoothly would. Um, and then it's actually really good for young parents or sorry, parents with young kids, because it it helps with bedwetting. So you would apply topically over the bladder if you have issues um, with your child wetting the bed. So you could apply that topically um, over their bladder at nighttime. And then um, it can help with things like swelling. So any edema you would apply on location, it can, it can help with that. Um, so aromatically too, um, it's a very interesting smell. It's more outdoorsy obviously because it's cypress it comes from a tree um but it's it's not too in your face so i love that about it but it creates a feeling of security and grounding so it would be a really beautiful one to diffuse um and then it pairs well with oils like bergamot or sorry bergamot lavender lemon orange sandalwood and even clary sage which is a really beautiful oil for especially females so that is my oil my oil scope or my oil live chat this week on cypress um i hope you enjoyed that i will be here again next wednesday with a new oil so if you have any recommendations or ones that you would really like for me for me to chat about let me know and i will take it into consideration and um We'll do these weekly every Wednesday at um, 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Oh, that's so good. Yeah, it's it's honestly, it's I, I love talking about oils that aren't very common just because there are oils out there that you might not know do amazing things such as this one. So it's, it's a real fave of mine right now. Anyways, I hope you guys have a great afternoon and I will see you again soon. Bye.